I just love the look of old sewing machines. I don't really use them, although a couple of them are actually um, in working order. And they, they harken back to a, a time of you know, things being handmade, so I do like that about them. Hi, I'm Tina Marks, and I am the owner of Straight Grain Studio here in Columbia. Really what sparked the interest in it was seeing the book Sweatshop Paris. Um, and these two women had opened up a shop in Paris that was a little sewing cafe, and it was a relatively new idea. How would I see my dream life would be um, a lot of people in the shop, you know, lots of goings on, coffee, the smell of coffee, people creating and talking to one another and um, really making cool things and kind of inspiring each other and inspiring me. I get energy from working with people, helping them figure out how to make something and teaching techniques that I know. Pull it back up. And then I might have to turn my wheel a little bit because you're going to hook. So yeah, that really is. I mean, I might like to live in Paris too, but that's an alternate life. <laughs> People that create things with their hands are happier. It gives them a better, um, gives them better self-esteem, even if it's making your own cookies from scratch. I mean, who doesn't love getting a homemade cookie? And who doesn't love, it's like, oh, I made this. This is great, you know? I think that's, and there's so much today that's instant gratification that I think that putting yourself into making something and, and creating something is has its own, I don't know. It just feeds your soul in a way that other things don't. In a certain way, I think at this time in my life, I'm trying to um, eliminate a lot of things that have memories, um, to try to make new memories and um, meet new people. And I love the idea that things are old and they have the patina of being used. Um, but I don't really want to take on any of the energy, if you will, of whoever owned it before because that could be good or bad. I just, I just try to enjoy the beauty of it and the, the integrity of the materials and go from there, really.